Hi, my name is Sibel, uh, and uh, I'm here uh, right now with Jillian. Uh, I'm going to ask her a couple of questions about social media and journalism. So, hi, Jillian. Hello, Sibel. Uh, so, uh, how do you see the impact of uh, social media on journalism today? Well, you know, it's been very interesting. Thank you. Thank you very much. It's been very interesting for me to put together the blog that I'm doing on newspapers and uh, and social media, um, because I found out a great deal that I didn't know before about uh, the the impact. And the impact is very very strong. In fact, social media is really changing the face of the newspaper industry entirely. Um, it's really bringing the relationship between reporter and reader much closer together. It's changing the style of writing altogether, uh, making newspaper writing uh, much tighter. Um, writers are, are writing in a blog-like style. Um, and then writers are also um, getting um, many more contributions uh, from outside of the, the, the newsroom from regular people. And we're, of course, seeing this very much in the news right now in the Middle East and, and North Africa. Uh, yes, I was going to ask you that, but do you see that as a, a short-term trend right now that everybody is using journalists as you are using Twitter or Facebook, or uh, is this trend uh, going to stay and change maybe uh, the game of journalism? Yes. I, I think that the, 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 the game has been changed. I think that there's there's no doubt about that. Um, now, uh, of course, we've seen uh, Tunisia and the use of blogs and the use of Twitter um, to spread information even after reporters were kicked out of the country. And then in Egypt as well, um, you know, now they're, they're detaining and arresting journalists, but of course this hasn't tamped down the information. The information is still flowing um, through social media, and I don't think it's a, a, any type of short-term trend. I think that we are going to continue seeing this more and more. Um, there's a Gannett executive who said that the future of content is conversation, and I believe that um, that this is the, the truth, that more and more um, it isn't, uh, you know, newspapers on one side and readers on the other, that the, that the flow of information is going to be much more fluid, and I think that it's a uh, that it's a good thing for for newspapers and the future of the newspaper industry, and then it's a good thing for democracy um, as well. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.